They do get the, uh, Lil does get his own D ward. He eats the, uh, sentry with his own tango, but, I mean, that's still a, a win for Roger because you, you still don't have vision of me. Gale's gonna oh, come out on Dendi, though. Yeah, they get the, uh, Fisher out. They will get the, the Gale, and they're slowing him down so much. I think this is a dead Dendi. I think Dendi's gonna be first blood. Yeah, no one gonna be first able to clean blood. up. <laughs> More popular, I think, is the Necrobook build, but uh, we'll see what he goes for. Ramsey's actually going to go for the dive here over onto General. We'll just keep... He goes... Denies the creep casually. Still just diving these two towers, and he knows that no one's going to be able to come over and help him because everyone's over here in mid. No one's in a little bit of trouble here. That shrapnel slowed him down quite a bit. Followed up with Roger. We'll be able to go ahead throughout an arcane bolt. And uh, he's sitting so low. There's the banana taunt on top of that. Meanwhile, over on the other side, Dendi. Dendi's stuck. He's trying to fight off. We'll get the kill onto Solo. Can Lil get the skill over onto Dendi, though? Yes, he'll be able to do it. But during all of that, no one actually gets the deny uh, neutral kill on himself. Oh. be working on that blink dagger, too. So you can run... You can't hide. Pasha will eventually catch killed. up to you, and he's going to be able to slow you down quite a bit on top of that. Roger is going to be able to go ahead cut this wave over here. Does run into Lil. They're able to land the Enchant Totem. There's the dust coming out, though. Uh, but there's no one really... Yeah, they'll be able to grab the Fissure. Try to block him in over here. The Gale comes out, and that's a dead Roger. <laughs> poor Spidey Sense is tingling over there for the Earthshaker. Poor, poor Roger. More bananas. He's trying to he's trying to find impact in here. Yeah, oh. so There's the Chronosphere in the top lane. They do have the Repel over here. They'll go ahead, though. Use the uh use the frost blast to bounce around, get a couple of hits over here. It looks like Snake gonna just try to run himself out. They don't have anything to cancel it out, although that heal bomb was very, very potent. And now Dendi, oh no, Dendi, he is in a bad situation here. Pasha will run for it. They'll be able to give this kill over to Ramsey's using that scythe, and now the chase is on after Crystallize. And during all of this general, actually getting himself a nice kill over onto Lil. Void coming forward, gets the Chronosphere off. He's got his eyes over onto Ramsey here. They also were able to go ahead, throw out that uh, track. And it looks like, unfortunately, Crystallize not going to work out for him. They are turning around, though. They're able to get a kill over onto Snake. Opasha, actually, the one to cover that. So we've got two. Like Roger. So doing some scouting around in the jungle, does run into basically all the Radiant team. He needs to be really careful. General's in a lot of trouble. The Aethos comes out, the Assassinate comes out as well. They're trying to take down no one. They will be able to take him down. Looks like General will get taken down as well, but Seneca will also get himself a kill over onto Lil. And now Ramsey's, oh, that slow coming out is not fun for him at all. The Shriek coming out too does slow him down a little bit. I don't know if they're going to be able to quite get him though. He's so very to this. And uh, we do see all the Plague Wards up here in the top lane that no one's just pushing out. Sentry Ward is placed down. They know that Roger is there. Yeah, there's the Frost Blast coming out. They'll be able to land a Fissure on top of that. There's going to be a nice heal bomb coming out. And the Enchant Totem with Lil will be able to clean up. So they got Wise and Roger just hanging out in that area. And they decide, yeah, that's not going to be happening ever again. Top lane, though, they do manage to grab no one over here. The Silence coming out. He's still going to be able to get that ultimate off. Gets the Gale as well. He does have a... A uh, full pipe, actually. No one's actually going to be able to walk away from this and get killed. Seneko's going to get taken down. He turns back around. He taunts over at the Void. Crystallize says, oh man, no, I do not want this. He doesn't have a TP, though. <sighs> He's going to get a double kill. They're going high ground against the Sniper, which isn't easy, but they're doing an okay job of it right now with that pipe, with all the heal, the sustain coming out here. It's pretty gross. Oh, the force forward. They spot Dendi over on the side. They throw out the Atos. They get the kill off. There's going to be a nice Chronosphere coming out from Crystallize. But what's he going to do here? There's the Fissure coming out. They get the kill over onto Sniper. Looks like Crystallize now. He's going to get Scythe on top of that. The buyback comes out from Sniper. They're not ready to give up just quite yet. Roger, you know, he's doing the best he can. He throws out a couple tracks, but there's not much that he can do. Dendi's sitting so far back here, just trying to do whatever he can to push them off. But there's not much that this little Sniper can do. We do see, though, Beastmaster coming around the other side here. Comes forward. He immediately gets Fissured over here by Lil, turning back. Back around and Chan Tony's just being stun locked. The Atos comes out, gets the yell off, but he's gone. And uh, first game of the series, Virtus Pro. Ramses drops all of his items onto the ground because, uh, you know, reasons. Virtus Pro victory. Because players or people in the lobby were not connecting, so we have to do it this way. It's not optimal. We're not happy about it either. But uh, First Blood actually bottom lane. Roger on his signature Chen going to be able to get the kill onto Enchantress. He is able to take Chen's creeps away from him. So we've kind of got this battle between... Uh... <laughs> what, what's happening here? 
<laughs> Roger, just kind of uh, waiting for Pasha to come forward. Makes a little wall of creeps, lands a uh, stun over onto her, and we see General now. He's going to go for the dive here. She does have those sprites. They're going to be running out very soon, though. This could actually be a very dead Pasha. The Hudukin, unfortunately, doesn't connect, and uh, still chasing after. I'm not sure they want to dive even for... They will, they'll go for the kill, and Pasha will get taken down. Don't give up comes out from General. The Midas, though, he wants to scale his level, scale into the late game, turn into a uh, bit of a core for himself. Chain Frost does come out, though. Yeah, it looks like Jinro's gonna be in for a lot of trouble. There's a glimpse back. They need one more hit, but they should be able to. Uh... No, he's actually gonna be able to juke around here into the trees. Is he gonna be able to make it out here? He's going to. Yeah. yeah. Nice. Nice play. Yeah, but pressure's on here yeah. for the bottom tower. We see that Rogers made the return. Oh, no! Solo! He does manage to get himself out of that static storm, but uh, yeah, there is a rotation for Crystallize. They'll turn themselves back around. No one. All his heal comes out from Chen, and uh, we'll try to chase after No one here. I think he's going to be able to get himself. Oh, the troll net, though, coming out will buy him a little bit more time. The kinetic field comes out, holds him into place. They're not even bothering to hit him. They're just going to go for this tower. Meanwhile, while that's going on, looks like General was able to clean up over on Ramsey's in the mid lane, but uh, No one going to be able to walk away from this, but they're just losing towers rapidly here. Keeping up his uh, fiery soul stacks as well. Does spot the Viper over here. Got the Weaver nearby as well. Viper Strike is used. I run to Dendi. Light Striker will come out. Nice dodge though coming out from No. And Crystal is going to move himself back. That's a very nice <laughs> cage coming out here with the Static Storm. Dendi trying to fight himself out here. He's still got a lot of just that. Another Toxin on him. The heal comes out though from Roger. Now Pasha being forced to run themselves away. There's going to be a nice glimpse back. Bo comes in though. Will land over onto uh, Seneca over here. Pasha's still alive though. So Spirits keep him alive. Oh, they're finally able to take him down though. Crystallize will get the kill. Runs face first over here into Solo. So this is not where you want to be. But there's a Ramses behind this corner. He will be able to go ahead. Maybe get this kill over onto Crystallize. No, the time lapse comes out. He's going to buy himself some more time. And now Dendi. He, oh, he has that Bloodstone in there. There goes some charges coming out as well to come join this, so. Looks like that's gonna go down and Crystallize will be able to get himself the Aegis over here. There's the boat coming in. Nice Chain Frost gets thrown out as well. Pasha, they've got their eyes over onto Dendi. They want to take him out. The stun's gonna come out. Doesn't actually connect though. Dendi, look at this. This is three different people trying to go over here. Meanwhile, Ramses jumps onto the back end here. Does have his eyes over onto General. Should be able to take him out with that God String. No one actually gonna be able to walk away from this. Oh, the bug's coming out though. Are they gonna be able to take it up fast enough? Crystallize, he wants to get this kill. It just gets popped though. No one actually still standing. Glimpse coming out. We'll bring him back. They'll be able to take him down. But now it looks like we're gonna lose Crystallize in the process. He tries to go ahead, time lapse it off, but unfortunately the cleave damage coming out from Ramsey's too much compared to what Sven is dishing out. Yeah, BKB is going to be next on the itemization here for the uh, the Viper. They do have a smoke coming in through here. Actually, no, that's just an invis. It looks like they will be able to go grab Ramsey's, throw him over here into the case. BKB comes out, though. I don't think they're anticipating that. He actually stops for a minute and they'll turn themselves back around, throw the storm hammer out. Should be able to go land over onto Seneco. That's a nice heal. He's actually going to get sent home by Roger. Nice play. Still running around. They've got the Glimmer Cape running up and over here onto Ramsey's. They do spot Roger, though, now. They'll be able to go ahead and get that kill at the very least. But they did protect. Uh, and still survive. So the Static Storm is going to be. Going top lane. Oh, him. Roger. Roger. The BKB comes out on top of it. Ramsey's just going to try to cut off this bug and maybe run himself out, or is he looking to go back in here? The rest of the team is coming forward. They do have a sentry. Oh, the vision coming out with the torrent. We'll be able to maybe take down Crystallize, although Lena on the back end here, she's doing so much damage over onto Ramsey's, trying to run himself. The Diffusal Blade comes out, and that's a big kill. That's 909 gold that's going to get dropped over here. But meanwhile, Crystallize is going to be able to scoochie him way out here but unfortunately it just doesn't do enough damage this is actually really well played by crystallize there at the last second he throws the uh the lincoln sphere onto the lena so that the first bounce of chain frost doesn't do uh, the damage. bkb comes out over from no one but look at all the damage that the lena's pouring out at the same time 
We'll protect them from the spells, but not from the right click. And it looks like uh, VP, they realize, all right, let's get back here. Oh, the glimpse, though. The glimpse comes back over onto the side. Can they get Seneca, though, here as well? Looks like Pasha trying to find that opening. We'll be able to go ahead, get that kill. Meanwhile, though, Dendi following up, and they're still chasing over after Crystallize. They can't quite find him right now, and there's a lot of damage coming out. The Lincolns gets popped, and oh, the damage pouring out from Ramses is just absolutely dirty right now. And they'll look like they'll just go for the retreat as the rest of the side of Navi chases after them. Dendi, Dendi's committed. Look at him. He's going to get the Light Striker right now over onto uh, Lil. They're going to be able to go ahead and use that Glimmer Cape, and he's going to try to juke around. They have Dust, though. They find him, and Roger actually going to be the one to take him down. Oh, and they find oh Solo, Solo. That Diffusal Blade doing so much work on Crystallize. It's, uh, it's a bit sketchy. Another 950 gold for his five back. Dendi gonna have to run him. So oh, Pasha comes forward. He's got the dust. They're gonna be able to spot Dendi out here. Can they slow him down enough? No, the torrent's not gonna connect. Lightstar Gray, though, also does not connect. Lincoln's gets thrown over here onto Dendi. Let's pull back over onto the side. Lil trying to find that opening. There's so much damage being put out. And again, Lightstar Gray will land over onto Viper. The X coming out, though. Should be able to take him down. Yeah, they popped the Aegis. Meanwhile, though, Seneca was trying to come into the picture. Has to run himself back using that Glimmer Cape. And uh, Viper now is in a little bit of trouble. No, never mind. He's got the uh, BKB, but look at all this damage coming out from Dendi. They will actually be able to take him down, force VP to run themselves back here in the process. The Glimpse comes back out over onto Ramses. He's just going to try to fight his way out, but the Light Striker reconnects, and they're actually able to just kite him down. That's a double kill now for Dendi. Really patient use. He holds on to the BKB until after he resurrects, lets his team come in, back him up, and on the back lines, General actually baiting out the BKB from Sven very early so that when he pops the God Strength, he doesn't have it. He's forced to back off. Then the glimpse from Snako comes out, and like I said, Ramses went all in for that Bloodthorn. They just call the GG. And they call the GG. Holy cow. All right, guys. Uh, again, sorry about this delay on the stream. We were being told that we we're going to be able to sit into the lobby, so we're actually just going to duck out here immediately. We'll be back with game two. So stick around. times but we are going to see Lil rotate up to the top lane instead Roger Roger's so patient he wants this courier oh no he's gonna get it yeah he's gonna get Radiant's it courier has been that's killed. the boots. boots are gone a little bit of a taunt coming out here oh that's right the uh default taunt Lil they're gonna get a kill on Dendi up here yeah Pasha gonna be able to get the first blood I don't think they have the damage to kill him and I don't know when that damage is gonna come online for them We've got wow. the babysitting coming out here from Solo too. Solo actually going to run face first over into Roger. Snako coming in as well. A couple bounces coming off here. It looks like it's still going to be a dead Solo, but no one. He's coming in here hot and he's going to try to help him out. It looks like Roger, again, he's very, very tanky. No one's going to be held in place here. Can't really run because of the rupture. We'll just kind of hang out, stand in place. And during all this, Dendi dies again to Pasha. And we he's good, but uh, he's got a mighty strong cooldown. Dyer's top tower. Dyer's top tower. Enchantress that's pushing. Yeah, Pasha is in a little bit of trouble here. We'll be able to go ahead, rupture her, followed up with a lot of the Firefly. They do have Lasso if they want to go and use it. They pop the drums. They're not going to need it. Why did you look at the Serpentine action? And then they go, they grab themselves a little, drag him back here through all of this Firefly. We'll be able to get the stun off, though, over onto Crystallize. We'll still be able to clean up, though. And that's two kills onto Crystallize, which he sorely needs. Very scary for the side on the V. Yeah, he's actually ready to fight now. Like, Alchemist can farm a lot, but when you get such an early Radiance time... Ooh, they do have, uh... Oh, the Cog's coming out. We'll actually keep Roger in place, but they TP right on top of it. There's the roll coming in from Lil and Seneko. He tries to use that ultimate to take him down. There's the armlet toggle come out from no one. A little bit faster there, a little bit sooner. He could have actually caught him before he gets up to the high ground, but unfortunately he's not able to get the rough ground. That has blink. Yeah, there's the jump forward immediately. We'll be able to take out the Witch Doctor. They do get the kill, though, over onto, uh, or the Weaver, rather. Oh my God. Jump forward. Spirits come out here from Pasha. They're going to keep running after them. They don't have that lasso. They just used it, trying to try to burn her down. Also doing a lot of body blocking, trying to keep Pasha back. They will be able to throw out a flame, frame flake, boom her back as well. And are they going to die this tower? Doesn't look like they're going to. Solo now in position. He's looking to go ahead, find a kinetic. 
Yeah. Glimpse comes back. That's a dead bat. Really nice play there from Lil, too. Like, he drops the boulder, kicks and silences in the same thing. Oh, he grabs Roger, too. So, Lil actually going to be able to roll in coming in from Lil. He'll be able to use the Magnetize still. Giving chase here. They're over by a shrine. I'm not sure if they want to continue doing this. We'll try, though. Anyways, Lil going to have to run himself back. He's just getting stunned up by that battery assault. Roger, he's going to get caught over here in the kinetic field. Roger's but uh, Rupture gets used over onto Sola. He's going to have to go and TP himself away during all of this, though. We lose Roger. On here in the woods, Lil looking over here on the side does drop a ward over here. Now they do have the sentry, it crystallizes immediately, pulls it down, so it alerts them. Glimpse coming back here, we'll be able to throw out the kinetic field. And uh, during all this, Ramsey gets a kill over onto Seneco, and they turn themselves around. Oh, that unstable concoction will land though and crystallize after getting a nice double kill. Unfortunately, will not be able finish up here. There's going to be another Cogs coming out. Looks like Roger is going to hookshot himself out over onto Dendi, but the glimpse is there, and it's actually going to go over onto Dendi. Unstable concoction coming forward. Oh no, our Thunder God's in a lot of trouble here. That last uphill miss, though. He gets over to the shrine, but it's not fast enough. The drag comes in, though. They're going to be able to at least be able to grab this disruptor. Get a revenge for possibly Solo running himself out, though. Those spirits, they were doing so much, but unfortunately, they get separated. Pasha was trying. Over onto Ramsey. A couple bounces coming off from Cass, but again, no one. He's got Aegis. He's really not too concerned. He goes ahead, he pops the Manta, turns himself around. The Maladie comes out as well. They're just trying to find the opening. Glimpse comes out, though. We'll be able to grab two heroes. Unfortunately, the Static Storm not going to be able to quite do it. The Yules comes out, though, does prevent that Rider from dragging into that building. He's going to get downed. Ramsey's now, he's got his eyes over here onto Roger. Roger trying to run himself back. We'll be able to use the Pog, save himself a little bit of time here. And, uh,. Pass comes out. Again, Maledict. They're just going to reset and go back in. Again, Alk has this Aegis. It's going to just go right there, throw out the unstable concoction. It lands over backwards and they get the glimpse off over onto Dendi. Dendi is toast. They're going to try to take out uh, the Roger here. Roger in a little bit of trouble. He does get healed up by the Bloodstone, but he might actually still go down during all that. Yeah, the acid spray on the ground still does the job. And uh, no one's back up. Yules comes out over here onto the side. Looks like they're going to try to... Oh, the BKB comes out from Crystallize, though. He's going to try to fight them off solo. Solo's actually going to get taken down, and no one realizes, okay, I guess it's time to go. Help me. Yeah, pretty much. I mean, I'm sure he's happy to have it anyways. More stats. Oh, boy. Crystallize and Dendi are in not a great position here. In fact, the Yules comes out. Looks like Dendi was trying to get out quickly. Not gonna be the case. He actually uses the suicide on his bloodstone. Crystallize is still good though. VP just march on towards victory here. I cry about having four. Yeah, that's what all mid players say. I cry about getting four <laughs> heroes in my lane. That's what I cry. About. Fair enough. Fair enough. They are trying to burst down this Alk again though. Alk. In a little bit of a bad position here. There's the Ags come out from Weaver, though. They've already used that lasso. This is looking so scary. Dendi trying to run himself out. The connect field comes in, doesn't connect, but he's just so slow. Ramsey's going to be able to go ahead, turn around. That Rider also going to get taken down. This might be game. I don't know. I don't feel like they want to give up quite yet. This is, you know, next one in. This Roche. I think that's GG. It's going to be a smoke up from the four of them. They're going to make an aggressive maneuver. BP might not see this coming. But... They have to. Let's jump forward immediately over here. BKB comes out here from Ramsey's. There will be a nice uh, hook shot over here onto the side, but they just have enough damage. They're able to take down Seneco. The roll coming forward here over onto Crystallize. Crystallize, there's just too much damage being popped out. He gets the rapture off, but it doesn't matter. Ramsey's doesn't care. There's a chase into the base. They're going hot in pursuit of Den here. We'll be able to go ahead, drop the unstable concoction. we will just kind of back off. Uh, Glimpse comes back in, though. They still really want to get the skill over onto the Thunder God. Pasha coming forward again, trying to slow him down. The magnetic coming out as well. And looks like, uh-oh, this is looking real scary for Roger. The defusal doing just enough slowing so that way Weaver can go ahead. And there's going to be the Yules coming out. Looks like General should be able to get himself back here. Glimpse comes back. Oh, look at that Glimpse range. Oh, my goodness. BKB gets taken out here with no one. He's just running around the base. He doesn't even care. He's like, yeah, I'm an alchemist. I've got farm. Life is good. Already Ramsey's dropping all of his items. He's feeling very, very confident. Don't give up. Enemy incoming. You can see no one immediately pinging, like, hey, if you haven't won yet, don't do the yeah. cloudy mm -hmm. That's all that they need, right? The ultimate three to Glimpse comes back out over onto Dendi. They'll be able to land the unstable concoction over here. Snago trying everything he can to do this, but it's just not going to be enough. Chris Lai still running forward. He's got his eyes over here. We'll be able to take down Lil. And now it looks like no one, no one on a little bit of problems here. He doesn't actually have the, uh, 
anyway. Coming back, the buyback comes out though. They want to finish this game. Ramsey's sitting so very low. They'll turn back around. There's the BKB coming out from Ramsey. There's going to be a nice extract coming in as well, but from no one, the GG gets called. VP going to make it to the grand final. That was just a. It wasn't even outplayed. It. That was just a straight. Thanks for watching. If you want more great content, be sure to hit that subscribe button. Wherever love flows, there is also tragedy. When we're in too deep, and you and I, we got history. Yeah.